you have a small dining room if so this project is for you so a lot of people want a dining table with six chairs at least and they also want a credenza in their dining room this particular space didn't have the room so let me show you what we did hey guys it's me kimberly we're doing nancy's dining room and this is how we go from drab to fab so the befores of this project super simple she had an old dining room table with folding chairs no bueno so we got to start from scratch my favorite and here's what we did so we went with an 88 inch dining table by 48 which is absolutely amazing because you can actually fit 10 people there eventually but six stationary chairs gives me 24 inches at least for each person the credenza now doesn't fit in the space because you need three feet to pull out those chairs so there's three walls in there we couldn't fit in there but what we did is we put it in the hallway made the space look finished and feel finished and was still functional because you can store things in the buffet that it's right there the dining room made a lot of sense typically i don't encourage people to put rugs in their dining room only if they're open to a living space i don't like two rugs for the most part side by side but this dining room was separate segregated on its own so we really needed to have a rug to ground this furniture. So because we chose the 90 cloud as our finish on our dining table and dining chairs, we needed that rug to, to ground it. We chose a sunbrella fabric on our tufted dining chairs because it's indestructible. You can even bleach it, which is incredible. And the credenza is the exact same color, 90 cloud with a mirrored front, 54 inches, absolutely perfect for that space. I love it. So now we're going to do black mirrors for on top of that credenza really funky they go in and out they're available online they're called the Canute mirrors they come in black and in gold they're my favorite right now and a big black piece of art black matting very striking against that light colored wall with a light light washed out frame I absolutely love that and for the dining table we chose a black bowl on a pedestal with some green and black foliage inside and on that accent wall right below the staircase we did two object pieces of art and you guys know how i feel about object art it's absolutely beautiful mix it up a bit yeah we could have done mirrors again but why do that object art is where it's at right now we staggered them it's fun it's interesting it's modern and i feel it ties in that whole room together in front of the mirrors on the credenza we put a lamp a nice smoky gray black lamp and then a black little piece of, I don't know what it's called, but it's just cute, it's cool. It's like a little piece of bark. And then two candle holders to balance off the lamp with some candles and that's it. That's all we needed to complete this space. So when you're designing small spaces, you really need a floor plan. If you don't have software, then get quarter inch scale drawing paper and make sure that you have three feet to pull out all your dining chairs. This is super important. You should plan for future if you're gonna put chairs on either ends of the head of the table. And credenzas are always nice to ground a space, so I sincerely recommend them in dining rooms. I truly believe you should live in rooms you love. Watch our videos and we'll show you how we take our projects to the next level. If you like what you see in these videos, please like, comment, and follow, and let me know what you'd like to see next time. If you have a space that you would like to get done, don't forget to sign up for our free design program.